Hey, this is Tom with InterstateLive.com. Um, we're here at Grizzly Rock for uh, Rockfest for Aurora Benefit. And um, we are here with... Randy Jasper. Marie Warden. Neil Warden. Um, basically what's going on today is this is the Rockfest for Aurora's for a benefit for the, uh, for the uh, victims and families of uh, the victims from the Aurora um, theater shooting. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about what the what the benefit is doing. Um, so, how did you guys get this together this fast? <laughs> <laughs> Them. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. I would say it was just um, a lot of people that were touched by it that decided to just open heartedly, to, to just willing to um, donate everything they possibly could because of how it touched lives of somebody maybe they knew right. or they knew somebody who knew somebody who was involved in it and they just were more than happy to open their hearts and everything to us. So how how did you go about uh, finding who you were going to contact? I mean did you did you have a lot of people in mind? Um, Actually, it, it just came kind of easy because we had like oh my god an overwhelming amount of people that were like Hey, you know, I'm in a band, I want to play, we want to do this benefit. Um, if we would have went, like, totally for every band and put them on the slots, we would have had it, like, a three-day. Yeah, about three days. We had 30 bands about to say they wanted at to play. At least 30 bands, at least. You know, and we had to turn so many bands down. There's so many great bands out there, and they were all willing to help. They all wanted to, to play for this benefit, so... Um, and I know this has got to be kind of hard for you guys because you guys have a closer personal relationship to the shooting um, than most people. Um, did it did it take you a little while before you figured you wanted to do something like this, or was it almost automatic? No, it was almost automatic. I mean, we I looked at Neil as soon as I found out, and I said, "We've got to do something." Yeah. And he said, "You know, yeah, we do." And and because of his background, because he's always helped out the Scudder Neil Foundation. He's like, you know, I'm so used to doing benefits, let's do benefits, and uh, and I contacted a, a good friend of mine, Randy Jasper, and I said, I really need your help, can you help me out with this? And she did, and it, it's been awesome. I mean, we have, like, such a great turnout, or, like, everything is going good, it's, yeah. I mean, it's yeah. been an overwhelming turnout so far, I mean, it's and it's still early, I mean, it's like, yeah. wow. Yeah, yeah the, the, place, the place is fairly packed already, yeah. I'm really, yeah. really surprised. Um, you guys got some great raffles going on. Yeah. Um, what what else is going on tonight? And after tonight is over, can people still donate? Definitely. Absolutely. They can give to um, givingfirst.org. Okay. Um, we're backslash uh, Rockfest for Aurora. Yeah. And they can give to that, or they can just go straight to givingfirst.org. I mean, you know, it, it all goes to the victims. And so we're a big community, and we like, we're all pulling together to help each other out. So. Yeah. Um, now, Neil, for for this benefit, um, they say this is your debut show. Is this something you got together for this specifically for this benefit show? No. Um, I put together a, a Motley Crue tribute band years ago, um, specifically just to raise money for the Cancer and AIDS for, for the Sky Neil Foundation, which is Cancer and AIDS for Children Research. Um, and then, um, you know, my wife and I we moved here. She's from here originally, and. She got me to come out here, and so I'm, I'm fairly new out here, about, about a year and a half now. Um, and, you know, I've been wanting to do it, um, put something together, and it's just a great cause to do it. So it, it kind of fell together at the same part as far as us playing it, you know. But I also f knew that, you know, with the name and, and whatever, it also helps raise, you know, generate buzz and tickets. And with crew being here a couple days ago and everything right. else, it was just, it just it was kind of like the right thing to do at the right time. Right. So, I mean, it was really cool because they donated a hundred thousand dollars between crew and Kiss yeah. towards uh, the benefits. So that, that's it, what I heard. Awesome. And and then not only that, um, I heard guitars. Yeah, Kiss Kiss wasn't able to sign a guitar because um, of contractual obligations, but Crew did sign one for us. Yes. So not only did they give um, a good, great monetary fund, but they also you know Crew also donated Absolutely. a guitar for us. So we have that sign. We're giving that away. We have. Um, as far as raffles go, we've, our silent auction uh, is we got a Peyton uh, Manning signed helmet, who's new out here. Um, Carlos Gonzalez, uh, Jason Giambi, John Elway signed a poster. Um, we have a full team uh, football from uh, from the Broncos for la from this year. So they all, all of them got together, signed a football for us. 
um, not to mention all the great um, local people that got together and did things. So. Um, was geez, I mean, uh, Water so, World so and so many. I mean, yeah. I mean, investors. We've had so many people step up and just. I mean, even today, last minute, they're like, "I have something. I have so much. You know, here's part yes. of the raffle. Here you go. I mean, and it's all yeah. kinds of things. I mean, it's anywhere from." you know just car washes all the way to a night stay at the denver marriott i mean there's yeah. variety Family four of packs of things. tickets to the rockies um they just right. donated a drum kit a full drum kit that we're raffling off wow yeah i mean i mean it's, I mean, it's amazing yeah, tickets for shows coming up here at the grizzly rock i mean we've I, we just I mean, it's been so overwhelming and everything that we've been doing and just everybody's <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, it's just been, been it's been amazing yeah. it really has and it's you know, it's just, it's so heartfelt that everybody has come together for our little community, you know, because Denver is big, but it's not that big, but just that everybody has come together and just, and they just want to help, you know. Well, it kind of goes to show that, I mean, the, the Denver community actually does come together as a family, but Absolutely. I mean, it's even reached further than that. I mean, yes. like, it's reached all over the U.S., all over the world. Yeah, I mean, um, it's, it's, it's been overwhelming and, you know, like I said, I've said before and other things, you know, the rock community has always kind of been overlooked as far as people that give. Right. And, you know, the rock community has been amazing. I mean, look at this. Absolutely. You know, seven, you know how hard it is to find seven bands that'll say, yeah, not a problem. And we had over 30 bands say, we'll play and we'll be there. Tell us what time we're playing. We don't care what it takes. We'll be there to play. We want to be a part yeah. of this. You know, and then as far as from that and then just the overwhelming response from all the sponsors, or not even sponsors, but just people giving. Everybody wants to give something. Absolutely. And that's what has been great about this too is, you know, it's another avenue that people don't know where to give or, you know, how to right. give or what they can do. Everybody wants to do something. Everybody sits on their couch and says, you know, I really wish I could do something, but I don't know what to do or where to go. And, you know, we've been blessed to be able to put, a, you know, a link out there and a thing just to show people know where what they can do. Even if it's, you know, 10 cents, you know, if you want to donate 10 cents, you want to donate $10,000. It right, doesn't matter. Right. Everything helps. And that's, that's what it comes down to is, yeah, yeah. you know, and it's just, it's been an overwhelming response Absolutely. from the community and, yes. and our friends and, you know, I mean, just, I, I don't know, I'm rarely speechless and I, I've got, I don't really have much, you know, and I'm, I'm back here crying. I got, you know, people are donating money. I'm like, yes, thank you. You know, I just, I don't know, you know, and I, I got awesome. a show in an hour. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's, it's a very heart, heartfelt day. It Absolutely, is. It's been amazing. Yes. It definitely is. And um, it, it's been very touching. Yeah. And we're so grateful for everybody that has pulled together the community. Um, friends, family, everything. Yeah, that Grizzly Rock, I mean, here. donated Grizzly the venue. Rock. Last minute, they just they like, just not said, a problem. You know, we'll staff well, it, we'll do whatever you need us to do. Absolutely, yeah. I'm just like, wow. So, okay. be, <clears throat> being that you guys are having, I mean, you can definitely call this success. Um, at this going forward, uh, any other plans? Um, whether it's it's maybe another rock fest down the road, depending on whether people need it, or, or I know you worked closely with the Skylar Neal Foundation. Um, anything else maybe uh, going forward in the future that you guys might yeah we have we, we hope that there's it. yeah we haven't really talked about it but we really hope there's not another tragedy that we have to do this yeah um, it, it's great to raise money for people that really really need it and they deserve it because you know they don't have their loved ones coming home anymore saying hey I love you or you know, goodbye, I'm going to work. I'll be home at 4 o'clock. We yeah, I mean, we know, earlier. I know that we, we came home and hugged our kids a little tighter that night. Yes, you know, just, absolutely. You know, you know, we were just and, like, and, and you know, I, could, I was really at work blessed. and I couldn't wait to get home. I was yeah. just like, I need to go home. Yeah, and we're really blessed that we, we have our family and our friends. Right. And all, all of this is our friends. I mean, all these people that are here today, they're our friends, family, and, and that's how we look at them, regardless if you know them or not. Yeah. These are our family. This is our Colorado family, yep. you know, and we've all pulled together and we've all made this happen and it's amazing. And we've all been, it's, <laughs> it's been a pretty emotional day, you know, because we're just grateful for everybody that comes out and spends $10 to come in and it's just like, wow, you're doing something yeah, to change it's, it's funny. this I mean, world. We've said thank you so many times today and people are like, stop saying thank you. <laughs> we should be thank It's like, no, you know, we're... We're so appreciative of yes. everything that everybody's done. I mean, just to just to show up and be a part of it, you yeah. know, for, for everybody. I mean, like I said, it doesn't matter if you bought a Ralph ticket or not. I mean, just to be a part of this and just to know, you know, that it, right. you know, well, it meant something to somebody to come out here and, and just yeah. do what they could. And, Absolutely. You know, we and we can't we try to walk around and say thank you to everybody. It's just. <laughs> <laughs> and within the first one hour that we've opened the doors, we've had over 300 people. 
at least. Yeah. So it's been really nice. I mean, it's a, it's a great community outreach to us. So, and we know that we're doing something for them. So it's perfect. Yeah. So how, I guess, for lack of a better term, stressful was this getting this together this fast? Oh my gosh, we all need new brains, honestly. We, we do, we right. all need new brains. Uh, I mean, it, it's been very stressful, but in the end, it's worth it. It's when we can smile and go, hey, we did this, right. it's yeah. worth it. Well, you know, I mean, in contrast, if you look at it, it usually takes about a year to put something like this on. Absolutely. Yeah. So, I mean, you know, like I said, again, you know, the community pulling together and doing anything they could, you know, and, and in the wake of other, other things that have been going on, the, the fires and everything yeah. else. So, right. you know, everybody's just been so amazing, you yes. know, just to, that want to give yes. and help, regardless of what it is. I mean, just Colorado been, rocks. That's yes. all I've got to say. Colorado, Colorado rocks. Rock. Yeah. yeah. Um, you know. Considering. I'm sure the families thank you. Uh, the victims thank you and and Colorado thanks you guys we don't this, need to thank awesome. you we That's want right. to do I, I, this I, 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 yeah, we, we want pleasure. to do this you know it's right. this has been our pleasure like, you know, like she said like I've said too I mean you know to be able to put something like this together this fast obviously somebody from above is wanting this to happen. absolutely and that's yes. that's really what it comes down to this is yes. what we're supposed to be doing and, and you know just to be uh, to be the vehicles to be able to be able to do it has just been yeah and we're glad that we can do it yeah you know we we're don't, glad we don't that want we, can help we don't want everybody. thanks and we don't want anything we just no. we're happy that we were able yes. to give it be a part of the community it's and amazing give back. Yeah. definitely definitely well this is tom from interstate live at the grizzly rock uh good cause rock fest for aurora um and you heard where to go uh say it one more time uh for people that want to donate after this givingfirst.org there you go uh, so you want to help out go there help out thanks we'll see ya <laughs>